Hey guys, it's Gay Gay. Welcome back to my channel. This is today's look. If you're interested in how I did this look, just stay tuned and watch the video. We're leaving out of summer with a bang and heading into it. No, I don't want to say bang because we know 2020 is a biatch. So we're leaving out of summer and heading into winter. So we're getting all our summery. Well, I do color all the time anyway. So hey, if you're interested in how I did this look, just stay tuned and watch the video. Hit like and hit subscribe and I hope you enjoy. Okay guys, so I'm going to be working from the Juvia's Place palette, the Berries palette, and the Violet palette. And I really don't know what I'm going to do right now. I was, um, I forgot I wasn't even recording. So I went ahead and placed this in my crease. And this palette, this pink color in my crease over here. Now I'm not really sure what I'm gonna do. I use the MAC white paint stick and I'm gonna add some more because it's creasing up because it's very emollient. So it does that. And I got this tip from Time the Infamous using the Mac White Paint Stick when you really want your colors to pop. Or you can use a NYX pencil. That's good too. Okay, so I'm gonna go in the crease with these, mixing these two colors. And I'm gonna pack them in kind of heavy. And I'm gonna go right above my lid. So going into the other palette, I'm going to take this deep purple and I'm going to pack that right on the corner and take it right above my lid. And I'm really packing that color on. I'm going back into the berries palette. Yeah, berries palette. Put some on my brush and I'm just going to buff out my edges. Man, that is not budging. Okay, I'm gonna have to mix it. Ooh, that has never happened. Okay, there it is. Ooh, I was not wanting to budge. That was not good. Okay, guys, and I'm just taking it up, blending it up, and excuse that noise. <laughs> That's my neighbor. I swear, everything could be perfectly quiet. As soon as I sit in this chair to do a makeup video every time, I don't know what the heck. Whoo, it's like they have radar. Now, little Miho is ripping and running. I don't know why he playing soccer in the house, but just late at night, you know, some people just can't live in apartments. You, you, you have to have a house. 
because you don't know how to live in apartments. But yeah, okay, but you see right here where it is not trying to, it is not trying to blend. This is Juvia's. I don't want to stand that because mama always got to blend on and stuff. I don't understand that. But uh, we're going to keep on blending, blending, blending. And here we go on the other side. We're going to... Ooh, try to blend that out. Ooh, we, I don't understand. What's, what's, what's really going on? This is my Juvia's. You don't get no better blending shadows than my Juvia's. It could be my paint stick, too. That's. The older you get, you can't do the same routine and methods that you used to do when you were younger. So you're constantly having to reinvent to see what'll work for your aging skin. I look 35, honey, but I'm not, I'm 53. It'll be 53 next week. And um, that's my confession. I always say I look 35, but I'm 53. Because I'm, I'm, I'm not going to say I look 63. I mean, <laughs> that would be stupid. Okay, so this one blended out a whole lot better than this. So it just might be this shadow or something. I, mean, I don't understand, but we're going <laughs> to gonna act like it is blended perfectly. Okay, uh, so we're going to go in to the Berries palette, and we're going to take this color right here, and we're going to put it... Ooh, that looks... That really looks really, really pretty on camera. It's pretty in person, but it's... Yeah. Okay, so we're going to put this right here. Woohoo! Look at that. Look at that. Just creamy. Buttery. Just buttery buttery but this is not as light as i had wanted it so what i'm going okay there it is right that's that's the one no it's not so what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna add another color on top of this because i really wanted this to be really really light A lighter color, but that's okay, you know what I'm saying? That's what you do. Okay, so I just need to find a, you know, a color to put on top of it. That is not blended. I'm gonna have to work on that. Oh my goodness, I'm not understanding. I'm not understanding. Okay, so I'm going to take the Norina palette and I'm going to take this color right here and I'm going to, well, I've already done it, but, and I've been placing it right here to lighten that color up. Yeah, because I want it to be light. How can you say to me? That dreams don't always come true. Maybe it's just you. Okay, and then I'll go back in and place this color to get it back to that berry. Yeah, like, like I like it. <laughs> like I like it. Okay, then I'm going to take this brush and I'm going to go into these two colors together. And I'm gonna work on this outer, outer eye right here. Yeah. That's how we do. That's how we doing. It's a story of a lady blending.
She was blending and blending and blending. She kept blending and she kept blending because it would not blend. Uh. Okay then. Okay guys, so I'm going in with this color here. Well, that's what I went in with already and I'm just taking that. on my lid. Okay, okay, y'all like that, like that. That is really, really pretty. That violet is really, really pretty. Okay, I'm gonna take it up a little bit. Just a little bit more. Okay, then we're gonna do the same thing that we did to this eye. I'm gonna go in with, back into the Norvina palette, and I'm taking that color and I'm going to place that on top. And I'm just doing something as I go. Some little makeup therapy tonight. I just felt like I just got out the bed and thought, I just want to try a look. This is not the look that I was going to try. The other one, I, I need a little bit more thought on how I'm going to do it. I was going to try it, but I'm going to need a little bit more thought on how exactly I'm going to execute that look. But I thought, I just felt like some makeup therapy, you know? It's late at night, and that's what I do. <laughs> so if you don't mind, I share it with you. Okay, we're going to go ahead and do a little liner. Please don't let my eyes water. Please don't let my eyes water. So we're going to use the Black Opal Foundation Truly Topaz. And, um, yeah. So I put a little on the back of my hand and my beauty blender. Don't judge me. Don't judge me. Because I keep it real. And, yes, I have all these beauty blenders over here that are so pretty and all this here yeah, but you know i ain't trying to front i just this works good once it gets really raggedy oh <laughs> it's perfect you know it's just the country in me that's all Driving in the back sun rooftop digging the scene with a gangster lean ooh, ooh. tv antennas in the back Oh, you may not have a car at all. Oh, I don't have no copyrights to no song. Is this a song in my head? Curtis Mayfield? Diamond in the back, sun rooftop, digging the scene where the gangster lives against the white walls. TV antennas in the back. Going in with Juvia's Place to conceal and highlight.
a good times. Leo. I'm going in with the violet palette, taking these colors, and I'm placing them up under my eyes. Oh my pillow. I said all I want you to do, all I want you to do, hold your one and tender body close to mine. Okay, so we're going to take our Winky Lux and we are going to bronze. Now, I didn't take the foundation down my neck because I'm not going anywhere and I don't feel like you know, I'm a woman of a particular age. I'm a senior citizen. And so all that tugging and pulling unnecessarily is not the business. You want to keep that skin as young looking as possible. And that's wear and tear on it. So, <laughs> yeah. Use the CI Tate London blush just for the balls of my cheeks. Apples of my cheeks, whatever you want to call it. Put that blush on it like I'm back in the 80s. <laughs> and this is the completed look. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Please hit like and subscribe. Hit that thumbs up. It's appreciated. Holla at you.